Hello again, this is Keith Searcy with Searcy Outdoors TV, coming to you with episode two of the Hart Chainsaw Unboxing. Uh, something I forgot to tell, tell you last episode was this chainsaw is equipped with a brushless motor that is, according to the manufacturer, is supposed to extend the life of the motor and also be uh, better operating uh, as far as uh, the amount of power it has. To uh, get started today, we're going to put some bar and chain oil in. And it says to drain the uh, tank with bar and chain oil before storing. Uh, in order to make sure it doesn't drip because it will drip according to the manufacturer's uh, instructions okay the next thing is we have to have the battery and the battery goes in the side right here uh, we've already checked the battery the battery has four blue lights meaning it's full and so now we simply just place it in and we should be ready to go I'm going to remove the bar guard and give her a test. So it does have a little lag uh, between trigger pulls, but I'm sure that's for safety more than likely. So let's see how it cuts. Seems to have a lot of power. Um, the course blade is new, so it's sharp and it is cutting very well. Um, the only thing I really don't like is the lag, but that's something you have to get used to with a cordless chainsaw. So let's make a few more cuts.
So it does seem to be a really good saw. It has a lot of power. Um, it seems balanced. Has a good feel to it. Um, like any chainsaw, you have to keep it, um, I guess you could say, uh, in hand really tight because it will get away from you. And so, just want to fill you in. Uh, we're going to see how long the battery will last. Uh, supposedly, it's supposed to make a hundred and um, something cuts on a 4 by 4 And so, we're going to do some more right here. So with that, um, we're going to make a few more cuts and then um, see if I can get it all tore apart. Uh, that concludes this video. Um, the Hart 14 inch cordless chainsaw. Um, I do feel it's worth the money. Um, and I will show you or give you a report on how many cuts we make um, as far as, well, how many how long it lasts, the battery. Uh, so, uh, we'll see you in just a minute. Uh, we had a little mess up. Um, the chain came off the bar and um, had to uh, figure out how to put that back on. Um, a little bit easy to do once I figured it out. Uh, has, of course, like all chainsaws, two uh, set screws and uh, one adjustment screw. Once I figured out how to um, get all that back together, um, we refilled the tank with oil again and we are back sawing. And uh, we have cut quite a bit of this tree, uh, this branch, big branch off this branch repair. Uh, probably about uh, at least two thirds of it. And battery's still going strong. Still got uh, one bar left, and I've made several hundred cuts. Uh, I'm cutting these branches up in small pieces to use for camp wood. So, um, with that, I'm going to get back to it and see you in a minute. Finally, the battery's run down. Um, a little over half, maybe two thirds of it done. And in the process of all this, we found the bird, or this bird. My daughter happened to spot him. Uh, I don't know what he's doing in the down lamb. The lamb's been down for over a month. But evidently, his mother's still feeding him. So we got to be careful not to touch him so his mother won't disown him so just want to let you know the battery is run down finally i'm well satisfied with the cuts being made um, the way it handles the amount of power um, it does a real fine job and uh, for what uh, cordless uh, chainsaw is um, I'm, I'm very well satisfied and uh, couldn't 
ask for a whole lot more. Uh, get the battery charged back up and I'll be back out to finish this up uh, and after a while. So see our progress here.